So we are on Mains of Lurk Farm at Nethy Bridge and the farmer Ian Smith, we're in a, an agri-environment scheme um, and one of the main features here is the waders in the wader grazed grassland. Um, so do you want to say a little bit about the farming, Ian? We've got near 500 yows, um, 60 cattle. Sheep are worked in both, well, two different sort of lots. So we've cross yows on one side, black faces on the other. Cows, well, the bottom calving cows on this side. Spring calving cows are here, everything's calved inside. So, I mean, there is a lot here because there's, there's moorland as well and you've got the river. Um, but this large area behind us of wader grazed grassland, um, it supports all five species of breeding farmland wader. Right, yeah, um, yeah. Over the years, what are the numbers of breeding waders like? Now? Now. Oh, nothing to put them on. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. no, no. Mm -hmm. How so, much rush cutting are you doing every year? 40 odd acres, maybe 50 acres in some bits. It just depends. And it depends again over in the flats here how dry it is, how much you can get onto it with the tractor. There's obviously certain bits you can't get onto it with the tractor. But if it's dry, it'll be cut. But not, you know, not every year. We'll maybe do so much one year, and then what didn't get cut will get cut the next year. So we just try and rotate it like that. You know, don't, yeah. don't cut it all at the one time. Because you've got you've got the ditches, you've got the unimproved areas, you've got improved areas, and then you've got um, just slightly mixed where there's cut rushes, emerging that's rushes. Right. Yeah, so right. you've really got that whole range vegetation structure, and there's some open water and some pools, um, and then you've got the hill behind. That's that. right. Yes, that's right. I mean, it is partly it is wet and it's rushy, but you're you're managing it for waders. Yes, that's right. 